unboxing is like a book and a toy. So Klutz um, has these great, you know, toy slash book um, activity kits and they offered to send me one and I chose Gravity Drop um, because it's Lego. Um, I have a lot of Lego fans in my home and also just thought it was cool because um, not only is this a book, <laughs> but also a toy, but also is a STEM, um, at, you know, it, it teaches STEM. So in this case, this is a design and build chain reactions machine. So you can think of it as one of those, what is it called? Goldberg something. Um, what is it called? I'll put it in the down box. It's, it's like those, um, it's like those machines. There's a lot of videos about it where people, um, make these crazy contraptions and then you start it usually with like a ball and then the ball rolls down then all these things happen and like it's kind of magical oh ruth goldberg that's what it's called or like a ruth goldberg machine so basically here you have all the elements to make a ruth goldberg machine but like not like a crazy one that takes up your entire house this one you know it's all built into the structure like they give you a plastic structure and then they give you all the pieces um it's all lego driven and they actually also explain how to set up i think all different types of gold you know these ruth goldberg um type of um gravity drop you know chain reaction um toys or reactions so it this is like this would be great for your if you have kids who like legos because um you know you it, it you know it is a lego toy and then also you could probably use legos that you own or incorporate these legos um into like once you're done playing with it <laughs> into like your normal lego you know stash um but what i like about this is that it is um you know, it's something that gets kids interested in STEM. And also, the once they build a reaction and they see how it works and they kind of, you know, do, you know it kind of explains how to do it. So it's, it feels like it's a little bit foolproof. Whereas I feel like real Ruth Goldberg um, experiments, when you don't have like a template, you're just trying to figure it out on your own. It's It can be frustrating because it's very much trial and error and try to get it to actually work. But here you have sort of a foolproof way of making a Ruth Goldberg. Um, and that I think just gets kids thinking how, how fun is this? Like we just created something and it did something crazy and amazing. Um, and then it kind of gets them thinking, oh, how can I extend past this? You know, either make up my own using other Legos or doing something more complicated with this set or maybe doing something and then adding in household objects to, you know, make a more extensive Ruth Goldberg um, contraption. So anyway, thank you to Klutz um, for sending me Gravity Drop with Legos. And um, I think I have a Lego fan that I will give it to um, as a gift for his birthday. Um, and anyway, thank you again uh, for watching and thank you again to Klutz.